is uh, my latest tech design. Originally, uh, we had the Smith Optics helmet speakers run with an audio cord directly into the phone. Uh, last season, I installed a mini amp in line, uh, but still had the wires running through from the helmet to my cell phone in my pocket. So uh, this year, I installed an, an Allure Tech Bluetooth receiver and jumped it into the FIO or FIO, depending on how you pronounce it, the uh, E11K Kilimanjaro Mini Amp. I uh, couldn't figure out where to put everything, so I made this pocket for it and attached it to the goggle strap uh, bracket that's on the back of the helmet. You can see here, the goggles on the front, comes around. There's a bracket behind here, it's kind of hard to see it, uh, the white part here. And uh, the FIO came with a rubber strap that has their logo into it. I just painted this onto it to kind of make it, uh, you know, a little bit more uh, visually uh, pleasant to look at. So it wasn't so awkward. Uh, made the, the pocket out of the pleather, that plastic leather, imitation leather. I even put custom on there. Uh, I think it'll hold up. Uh, the FIO... E11K is not just an amplifier to boost uh, volume, uh, but shapes the audio signal, keeps it clean and drives the bass uh, really nice and gives a responsive uh, gain of about 11 dB. The audio is crystal clear, loud, with no distortion. So I think I'm going to be very happy with this. Uh, over here on the other side, uh, for now I just ran the cord. I got a small hole in the bottom just ran the cord inside of here. And it's connected to the helmet uh, speakers inside. There's a zipper along here that tucked everything in. Uh, I was really pleased with the Smith Optics uh, speakers, the one shots. The other nice thing that I added was the goggles. They're the actual uh, Smith uh, Vice goggle, Vice brand uh, goggles. Uh, a little bit on the costly side but i think they're going to perform well they've got a reflective a uh, different reflective uh, tint to them uh i can't wait to use it